Hi everyone, in this video we're going to be quickly rendering out some images of the armor we modeled last episode, just to use as icons for the game's inventory. So I have a new Blender file open here, and I'm just quickly going to delete the default cube and light. And I want to go into File, Append, and navigate over to the Player Blend file, go into Object, and I just want to append the Plate Leg, Plate Body, and Helmet. All right, so I'll append those. And with all of these selected, I'm just gonna press Alt-G just to uh, position those all at the center of the scene. I can get rid of this armature here. And I also wanna move each of these onto their own layer. So I'll leave the plate legs on layer one and then have the plate body on layer two and the helmet on layer three. All right, I'll now press one to go into front view and then Control alt 0 to snap the camera to my viewing position. In the render settings over here, I then want to change the resolution to something square, say 800 by 800. And then I can just select this and say scale it up to uh, fit this little camera window. And then let's press render and see what happens. So it's rendering out completely black since there's no light in our scene. I'll go into the world settings here and just add some ambient occlusion, say with a factor of 0.8. And if I render this out again, I can just press F12 to do that. We can see we're getting quite a nice uh, rendering. So the only thing I want to do is just uh, make a transparent background. So I can go into the shading options here and just change alpha to transparent. And then if I render this again, the background will be transparent. Now, currently the render is a little bit grainy, so we can go back into the world settings here and just up the samples uh, under the gather settings. So if I change that to 10, for example, press F12, you can see that's a bit higher resolution. So uh, I want to save this image. So I can just go to image over here and save as image. I'll then of course just choose where I want to save this on my hard drive and I'll give it a name, say plate legs icon and press save. Then let's go back to our 3D view, go into layer two. This is the plate body. I'll scale this up to the correct size and press F12. All right, that looks good. So I will save that as well call this the plate body icon. And then we just need to go onto the last layer, scale this up as well, maybe move it up a bit, F12, and let's save that. So this is the helmet icon. Okay, so that is actually already everything for this episode. I will be sure to save this blend file so that we've got our uh, camera and light settings set up uh, for when we next want to render out some more uh, icons. But for now, that is everything. So until next episode, cheers.